So the smartphone revolution, the revolution in connectivity, has created an on-demand economy. As Kevin Kelly says, access is now more important than ownership. The idea that goods and services are just a rub on a magic mirror away from being fulfilled. This notion of extending our will, magic, as Alistair Crowley described it, as willed intent. I summon and it appears. As I imagine, so it becomes. And this is the very essence of magic, which is a great line. And this is the world that we're living in now. Services like Uber, services like Airbnb, that will literally summon the ability to go stay somewhere and the means to get there at the speed of thought almost, are scaling to the point that we are seeing a transformation in our phenomenological experience. We are creating a technologically mediated flow where most of the world becomes an extension of our agency. I mean, even the fact that Uber can sync with your Spotify playlist so that when you summon the car to take you to the place that you want to go, the car arrives and the music that you've previously soundscaped is already playing in the car, giving you the serendipitous experience of moving into spaces where all of a sudden everything's amazing. This is the song I like. This is the place I want to go. Oh, let's go somewhere. Oh, here's the car picking me up. Oh my God, I want to go stay at this beautiful mountain town. Oh my God, here's the apartment waiting for me. Just an Airbnb again. I mean, this on-demand economy is transforming subjectivity. When we surrender into it, when we surrender into the space and the speed of the feedback loops between our creative choices and what is able to be summoned through our technological extensions, our technological scaffoldings, we actually step into a new space of consciousness. We step into a new way of perceiving reality. The whole thing becomes mental architecture. <laughs> we cognitize the world. That's the AI revolution. That is the on-demand economy. We extend our cognition, our mental neuroarchitecture out into the world. It all becomes dream space. It all becomes a lucid dream. It all becomes an inception that we can control. That's the flow that is promised by the on-demand economy. I find it very exciting, very exciting.